Thomas Pannone took the mound for game one of this championship series. His Hillcats got the win and then dropped game two. So they're taking a series tied at 1-1 back home to Lynchburg. Thomas joins me now. Thank you so much. Yeah, thanks for having me. So you started game one of the championship series. How did you learn that you got the nod and when? Um, actually, we were celebrating after we beat Potomac here. Um, I was in the locker room celebrating, and then Rigo called me over and told me I was starting game one. It was either between me and Hartson. Uh, I was actually scheduled to pitch game two. He was supposed to be one, but we just flip-flopped, and uh, it was definitely exciting because I, I was definitely ready to go game one. So Was it an honor to be able uh, to kick things off for the Cats? Yeah, it was definitely an honor. I mean, uh, anytime you get to pitch the first game of the series of anything is pretty cool, so it was definitely an honor. And you found out that Myrtle Beach was your opponent yeah. after celebrating with Potomac. Yeah. The what was it like to go from that celebration to hopping on a bus for an overnight trip when you could have just gone down to Salem? Yeah. Um, I mean, we definitely would have preferred to travel to just Salem, but, I mean, anyone that won that game, um, Salem or Myrtle Beach, we were ready to play. So it was just a matter of who it was, and it happened to be them. And we packed our stuff up, I think, in less than an hour, and we were on that bus ready to go. So. And your parents also made the trip down there. Did yeah. you know that they were coming? Yeah, I did. Uh, my mom and dad told me about two weeks ago that wherever I was in the championship and if I was going to pitch, they were going to come and see me. So um, we won the game, and I was in the locker room. My mom was, like, immediately texting me, like, when are you pitching, when are you pitching? And I ended up pitching game one, and I was like, I'm pitching tomorrow night at 6 o'clock. And she immediately got right on the computer and got a flight for her and my dad down to Myrtle Beach. They wouldn't miss you pitching, no. would they? <laughs> no, they wouldn't. Does it give you a boost when they're, they're watching you? Yeah, it you? definitely does. I'm, and since I played in Pro Bowl, every time that they've shown up to a game, it's just, it's just a little something extra that you know that they're in the stands watching. I mean, even if they can watch it on uh, online on, on um, some teams that have uh, the broadcast or, or whatnot, it's just different than being in the stands. and So it was pretty cool. Do you get extra nervous? Um, Just a little bit. Not, nothing serious, but... Definitely no want to definitely want to pitch good in front of them. Parents there, championship series, game one. Yeah. <laughs> no big deal, right? And how did it feel to step on the mound for game one, pitch a great game, mm -hmm. and get the win? Um, or the team get the win? Yeah, the team got the win. I didn't get the win. But uh, it was definitely definitely awesome. I mean, definitely wanted to get the, the team off on a, on a good note there in the first game. I felt like I did that. And uh, happy we got the win. Definitely happy we got to pull one game out of that series, out of the two down in Myrtle Beach. So uh, definitely on for tonight. And there's a chance that you could pitch again Friday, or game mm -hmm. five if yeah. necessary. Yeah. How do you stay mentally prepared and focused knowing that you could get that call? Yeah, um, I, I just don't want to change anything that I've been doing day to day. I'm come out, I don't want to come out here and take a day for granted because my season's not over yet. Um, if I was in a situation where my season would be over, it would be different, but I have to stay locked in. And as you mentioned before, the series is tied at 1-1. Yeah. Back home here in Lynchburg, is that home field advantage going to give you guys an edge? Yeah, I definitely think so. Um, just playing in front of this home crowd and being somewhere that you're comfortable, I think, I mean, just waking up and knowing that you woke up in your apartment or your host family, wherever you're at, and, and coming into this locker room and being in this environment, I think, is better than, I mean, being on a bus, waking up in a hotel and all that, so... Have you let your mind wander to winning it all, or are you still taking it one day at a time? Um, I mean, I'd be lying if I said I didn't, but I definitely want to just stay focused on today. But, I mean, yeah, I have had thoughts of winning it. After that first celebration, that was pretty cool. We have, too, but there's yeah. still some baseball to be played. Yeah, I thank you so much for taking yeah, time out of anytime. your day to join me, and yeah. good luck. Thank you. Thank you so much. Yeah.